Questions for Cam? Cam, we talk about the offense and you guys ready to play a game. You think you're ready to uh, play well again this year? Uh, yeah, I think um, I think we're ready to uh, play this, play well this year. Uh, we've been preparing, um, working on working on the offense, just working on the little things, trying to trying to be perfect if we can, and uh, that's just what we've been working on. Darren, when you first got here, you obviously wanted to win the starting job. We see the depth chart now with you and Corey, but how how much are you still still believe that you can be the guy by the end of the season? I mean, well, you always got to believe in yourself, so I just believe I can be the guy. But I mean, that's up to the coaching staff and what they feel is going, what they feel is working and being effective. At the end of the day, it's about the team, not the one individual play. So. What do you what do you feel like you two can can add to the offense, switching in and out and adding some different things? I mean, I feel like we can add a lot to the offense. You know, as everybody knows, Corey runs a four-one, so I mean, we can't you know find that everywhere. But I mean, it's a lot of different dimensions I think we add to this offense, and you know, hopefully, y'all be able to see it. How much have you kind of changed your game a little bit to not just be a downhill guy, but break that mold and become more of a every down back? Well, I mean, I want to say I changed my game too much. Uh, I mean, y'all look at back when I was getting recruited, I did it all, but I mean. When I got here, they put me like in a little, I mean, I got kind of in a box from y'all, but I mean, <laughs> all in all, you know, I mean, I feel like I can do it all y'all. How yeah. much in, in the second year of this offense, how much does that comfort level help everybody and in, in, in you being in the second year of it? Uh, it's helped tremendously, though. We're a lot further along, just an execution, just an execution phase of what we were last year. So, I mean, it's just, you know, being comfortable and being aware of your surroundings and knowing what's coming next, uh, it helps a lot. Yeah, to be that lead guy would require probably carrying the ball over 20 times a game. You haven't done that yet here. You've done that, obviously, in the past. How confident are you about just durability? Just because you haven't done it, I'm sure you're confident yourself, but. Oh, I'm built to last. I ain't worried about that. I can do that 20 times a game. That ain't nothing. What have you seen out of that Casanova Oh, um, he, he's improved tremendously. Uh, so is the so is the defense. You know, another thing was just being comfortable and knowing knowing the defense and all that type of thing. But I mean, Cash has had a good a good camp and he's looking to have a good year. What have you What have you seen out of Rock Thomas? Oh, uh, he he's really good, explosive. He's quick. He has good speed. I mean, he's everything he's advertised to be. Uh, I mean, he, he'll be a real good player here. I know that. Do you think he could challenge you guys as the season progresses? Is that in the back of your mind at all, or? <laughs> I don't know about uh, I don't know about that. So you're gonna have to ask the coaches about that. I'm not worried about that. I'm just worrying about trying to do what I need to do. You, you call Shady this week? Have I talked to him this yeah. week? Nah, I talked to him last week, but I probably talked to him as the game get closer. What'd you say? Hmm? What'd you say? Uh, no, we just talked about we just talked about the season, how uh, how he hope his season go, I hope my season go. Not amazing. We talked about family things like that. How much will the in improving in the passing game, having those guys outside? How much you think that can can help you guys in the running game as well? Uh, that helps us tremendously. We can get different fronts, uh, more run friendly fronts, and uh, I mean it is just help us as a team. You know, with that dimension working and clicking well, I feel like we can be better than we were last year. What kind of opportunities do you think you guys will have in the passing game at running back this year, coming out, getting in the flats, do some stuff, getting space? I'm not sure what kind of opportunities they have. You're going to have to ask Coach about that. As far as, you know, what, what he's planning on doing, I don't know. You know, Coach Niles, I'm always thinking of something new, so who knows. Okay, last year you guys, you know, you, you guys had a lot of confidence, even though you weren't ranked and, and, and coming off the season you had two years ago. What's your confidence level like this year? What are kind of the expectations you guys have set for yourself? Uh, we got high expectations. For us, so and um, we're confident that we can uh, we can do what we did last year and uh, hopefully finish up what we uh, fell short at. Cameron, has the coach, has the coach, coach staff told you guys, like you know, the running back, that probably it'll maybe play out like last year as far as yeah, you guys are kind of listed as one and one a right now, top of the depth chart with you and Corey, but maybe by game three, four, five, one of you guys will be kind of the guy that gets the twenty carries a game. Or have they told you anything like that? Nah, they haven't told us anything like that. Uh, right now, we know what we listed at, we know what we stand at, and uh, now it's just about going out and performing for both of us. So. Yeah, we talked about the offensive line, how it's been looking. 
Uh, offensive line, they always look great. I mean, uh, they got a great coach that preaches technique and the little things, and those guys get better every day. You know, especially going against our defensive line. So I mean, iron sharpens iron, I guess. Yeah, Sean, uh, obviously replacing Greg, uh, pretty big shoes to fill. A lot of guys have talked about how strong and how physical he is. What do you see when when you watch Sean Colton out there? He's definitely strong and physical. He has really good feet. Uh, it's quicker than most people give him credit for, and. Um, I mean, I think he'll do a great job filling those shoes. So you, you were there, obviously, last year at the Ironworks and the Bedlam afterwards. What's it going to be like this year, the first game back at Jordan Harris since, since that moment? Uh, I mean, we'll be excited. I don't know what it's going to be like. You know, we got you know, we got the greatest fans. So, I mean, I know it's going to be <laughs> it's going to be definitely a, a great atmosphere. So, I mean, I'm just looking forward to it. And you might be in the locker room when they play the video, you know, on the tempo drum. Is that going to be a pretty big moment whenever they Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to hear him. So, <laughs> you know, that'll be a big moment. Yeah. Your, your family going to be able to make it down for the game? Uh, nah, they ain't going to be able to make it down for this game. They'll be down for the more games than they were last year, though. So that's a good thing. So yeah. what do we expect that first con- – what do you want the first conversation to be like with your dad after? Normally he says it to you in person if he's here, but what do you expect – what do you want to be able to say to him after the first game? I don't know, man. Good game, I guess. You know, that's, that's, that's what really you always want. You always want to have a good game, especially coming out, trying to set a statement for this year, set a tone for this year, this team. So, I mean, that's, that's the biggest thing. Ken, you also said there's a plan for when Nick will enter the game. The quarterbacks know it. The coaches know it. Does the rest of the team know it? Do you all know it? This I have no idea what the plan is. They know it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you know. I would hope that maybe y'all can tell me something, but I don't know. Does that concern you at all? I mean, going into it, not knowing, or you just no, no. Um, it doesn't concern me at all. Uh, we got two great quarterbacks, so that's always a, it's always a good problem.